Well, for many Hispanics voting this year, immigration will be a deciding factor in the selection of a presidential candidate. KJNS News reporter Valerie Gonzalez shares why it's a topic that has the potential to shape the election. Valerie. The Latino community is growing, with some estimates putting it at about 58.1 million in the United States. Growing alongside it is the electorate, which is estimated to be 16 percent of the country's population. It's important to recognize the size of this growing minority in the U.S. to understand how their decisions at the polls can shape the current election. An independent study carried out by Latino Decision finds that 67 percent of Hispanics they polled said immigration is a key topic when they select their candidate. But even if you're not part of the Latino community, immigration is a hot button issue for a large portion of the population. And many people do perceive immigrants as a threat, if not to directly harm, indirectly harm, in a sense of taking jobs and or uh, enrolling people in school systems where they're not necessarily paying taxes. Well, that's not necessarily true. Another part of the findings from Latino Decision is that while Latinos blame a lack of immigration reform on both parties, the blame is more directed at the Republican Party. Tonight we'll hear from eligible voters in Laredo to see if their opinions line up with the study. For KJNS, Valerie Gonzalez. All right, Valerie, thank you. And Latino Decisions is also clearing up the recent Trump claim that he was number one with Hispanics in the Nevada caucuses. They report that while a majority of the registered Hispanic Republicans voted for Trump, 93% of Hispanics in Nevada did not vote for him.